disclaimer, this is my first time playing. We are playing Dave the Diver today. I feel like this is just a game that if you haven't seen it, we're gonna absolutely love this one. I feel like it has like us written all over it. It's like a cute little cozy diving game. Uh, and yeah, apparently we get to run our own sushi stop. Sh stop. Our own sushi shop. Wait, that's really hard to say. Sushi shop. There we go. And you know we love the cozy vibes chat. And feet. Oh my god, is that a little her that's a hermit crab, right? Is that a hermit crab? Thanks, Agent Diva. Sushi. I love the music. Oh, this looks good, man. Oh, I never liked root beer. You guys like root beer, chat? I wonder if I'd like it now, because I feel like I only ever tried it as a kid, and it was always a bit, like, like spicy. Just a bit, a bit weird. I probably would, uh, I feel like my taste buds have probably changed a lot. I'd probably like it now. I love root beer. I prefer cream soda. God, I haven't had cream soda since I was a kid either. I used to love cream soda when I was younger. Yeah, I am getting Stardew vibes a little bit, to be honest. I don't know what I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's just the pixel art or the music. All right, I don't want to skip anything, but at the moment we're just watching like the credits, you know. I feel like it might be okay to skip this. Oh, I'm scared to skip it. We can vibe with this. Alright, so we were chilling on a beach sunbathing. There was a hermit crab there. We oh, we got a phone call from Cobra talking about sushi. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know? So where's the sushi at? Don't rush yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. <laughs> he says while wearing a... Oh, it doesn't matter. I've never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecolog ecology changes, which means this could be an incredible business opportunity. What kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go, go on in. I don't have a good feeling about this. Prologue, a sushi bar by the blue hole. <laughs> Sorry, that's literally not even funny. I was going to make a joke about the fact that Dave was like, there's a massive blue hole. And I was going to say, he says while wearing a blue wetsuit. But then I realized, firstly, not, I shouldn't really say that. Secondly, you guys couldn't actually see the, his like avatar thing because it was covered by my camera, so... Yeah, I was thinking the same CP Snells. I'm just going to move my camera really quick, guys. Just in case. I feel like... I feel like we're just future-proofing ourselves by putting our, ourselves up here. And then let's just put the daily uh, there. Let's get that off the screen. Oh, I've got to find the sea because the clouds. Where is it? Wait, what? There we go. Okay, that looks a lot better. That looks a lot better. Right, try moving with the try moving to the arrow with W S A D. All right, cool. Space bar to dive. I'm excited. Wait, I feel really excited. <laughs> Fried egg jellyfish. What? Ooh. Nice form, ha 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 ha. All right, how about try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. Shift, you can move quickly. This speeds up oxygen consumption. All right, that's impatient. That's impatient. That's important for my impatient ass to remember because I'll just hold shift all the time. 
Looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a fresh water snail. Nice. Practice using the weapon. You'll need in contingencies. Try using the survival knife on small fish. Oh no. Oh no. Come here. Come here, you little shits. Oh no. Wait, what? Well done, smooth and quick. Thanks, Cobra. Finally, you haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? The harpoon? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then, hmm. You literally knew this was a hunt for your own sushi restaurant game? Yeah, okay. But if there was like a massive squid trying to attack me and I needed to harpoon it, it's like a little bit different to a tiny little cute orange fish, you know? Looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Aim with right click and fire with left click. All right. Ooh, it slows down. Oh, wait, it has a range on it. Okay. I'm whiffing? Oh! This is making you want to play Subnautica. Valid. Subnautica is a... I was watching someone play Subnautica the other day, actually. I can't remember who it was. Golf Such a good boy, game. Click. <gasps> Hi, V-Rat. I think that should get you back on track in no time. All right, come back up to the boat. V-Rat, thank you so much for the 21 months. I really appreciate it. Welcome back, man. I hope you're doing okay. All right, we've got the basic skills down. Shift to move fast. Right click to harpoon. Left click to little knife. You love sushi, mm -hmm. right? For sure. Soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh man, that's just the best. Well, listen up. I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has one skill I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. The sushi <laughs> here is made from the fresh fish caught in the blue hole, where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people will just go nuts for it? People do go nuts for, like, yeah. Why don't you join in on this awesome venture as well? What do you say? I love eating, but I don't know anything about cooking. Nothing to worry about. The restaurant is all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. What happens if I decline that? Just like GG game over? I could eat as much sushi as I want. Yeah, sure, but you have to pay. It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Ha 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 ha. This guy loves to laugh. This guy really loves to laugh. Let's go to the sushi bar. Wait, this is cute though. Avocado sushi is better than everything. Great. Th Honestly, I genuinely agree though. Even before veganism, Arvo Sushi, bro, Avocado Sushi, a little bit of pickled ginger, a little bit of soy sauce, a little bit of, um, wasabi. Oh my god. Hey, Bancho, are we all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. It's already finished. Are you the fisherman Cobra was talking about? Yeah, I am. I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. I'm Bancho. What's up, Bancho? I sure do, tuna belly, seal, ur se seal urchin. Yep. Just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Just as mediocre as expected. Huh? Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone. Yeah, we just got roasted. For real. Wait, earthquake? Storm? The more endangered the fish, the tastier. Bro, <laughs> that's actually, like, genuinely would be a thing, actually. Uh, Cadnez, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. The interior is really quite a mess. It looks like we'll have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. First, we need ingredients. I have something I just caught. 
Only three fish. This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch seven more fish. And the restaurant is going to be open only in the evening. Won't that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? It's a chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision. Just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. You'll need me to get the best you'll need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Alright. On it. Let me go, man. All you've done is insult me since I've been here. Let me just go catch catch my fish. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. Wahahaha. I haven't seen Ban Bancho so en enthusiastic since the incident. Wait, what's the incident? You're not gonna tell us? What the heck? Alright, well, let's go diving. We are a diver after all, it's what we do. A Mediterranean parrotfish found in the warm waters and near rocky somethings. Okay. Alright, let's do it, chat. I'm in the giant blue hole. I have a left slash, I have my harpoon gun. Where's my oxygen? Oh, bottom left. Okay, so can I go to the surface to breathe? No. So I just have to like do as much as I can while I'm down here before I go back to the boat. So I need to make a hundred gold and prepare sushi ingredients. Catch fish, zero. We're going down, chat. The deeper in the hole, the tastier it gets. We'll have one of those. A blue tang. Tangy. That's a tangy one. We're gonna have to go deeper if we want to get rid of the tang. <gasps> I'm under attack! Wait, they've got multiple health! Two red lion fishes. Okay. We see, babe. Right, I need to stop holding shift because I'm running out of oxygen really fast. <gasps> Yo, what is that? Whiffed! Come here! No! Whiff! Oh my god. Guys. Help! Oh, they're all gonna laugh at me when I go back as a failure. Oh, they're gonna laugh at me when I go back as a failure. What? I can't die on my first dive. I can't. Oh my god! We made it. It's fine. It was literally such a successful, successful trip. <laughs> That was such a successful first trip. <laughs> okay, dive number one. Weather was sunny. We were un we were under for one minute thirty six, which is a, a new record. That's a world record. We went to forty one meters depth, which is also a world record, and we caught three fish, which is also a world record. And our biggest fish was the red lion fish. Nice. Okay, two fish tank. Oh, yep. Yeah, thumbs up. Nice. All right, let's go back. Successful sushi strip <laughs> for the sushi shop. <laughs> Who dies the O2 Sabo? Hey, chat, can we do something? It's been three years. Can we, like, not among us everything? Didn't we need seven fish? Well, yeah, that's why we're that's why we're heading back down into the deep, dark depths of um the blue hole. God, I knew holding shift. I knew holding shift was going to be a problem for me. Oh, a clownfish. My impatience is, uh... I think I held shift the whole time, Kestrel, without thinking. Oh, we got to radio this in! New content, escape pod. Use the escape pod to escape your to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first, as cooling the process takes some time. And we got a, a chest, treasure chest. We got a shock bang stick. <laughs> we got a shock bang stick for the deep hole. Oh my God. This is amazing. This is the best dive ever. Nice. Oh my God, I'm cracked. I'm the best diver ever. That was a long fin batfish. Whiff. Nice. Whiff. 
<laughs> Not everything has to be an Among Us reference, chat. That's all I'm saying. Nice. Ooh, a red tooted. <laughs> a red tooted. I really need to catch one of these. We're going to go back with the most variety possible. Oh, fuck. Wrong, wrong one. Sorry. Wait, we're in critical depth right now. Black and white schnapper. Uh, okay, I think I think jobs are good, and right, chat. Let's go back with all our catches. Oh my god, unbelievable! One of you guys as well. Nice. I'm just letting them get away because I feel bad because they're so cute. Nice. Apart from that one. Wait. Oh, it's fine. We got 26% O2. We're chilling. Uh, Olax, thank you for the follow. And if anyone is new here, please don't forget to follow the stream. I'd really appreciate it. Critical depth. <laughs> attack, attack. All right, looks like you caught quite a few. It's night time. At this rate, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. <laughs> my, my, would you look at the time. I think I got more than seven fish, chat. More. We'll have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? You know, when you guys described this game as, like, running my own sushi bar, I was like, ah, oh, cute. But it seems like everyone I'm running it with aren't very nice. Okay, we got into some new... Oh, we caught eight fish on that trip. World record! Oh, okay, so certain fish... Oh, you can see their prices. And you can also see how much food they make, I guess? Wait, so it'd be two... Oh! Does that mean it's two gold times to buy four? Because then it's still worth eight gold, but this one's worth 30 gold. Which is really nice. So, no ingredients collected. Oh! By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Thanks, Cobra. This is giving Fish Tycoon vibes. I love it. I've never played Fish Tycoon. I did used to love the Tycoon games when I was younger, though. Like, Hospital Tycoon, where you could make their heads explode. And Roller Coaster Tycoon, where you could make them really sick. Like, you could cover your whole theme park in sick. But it used to... I have a metaphobia, so I have a phobia of vomit, basically. Even the word vomit makes me feel sick. Um, but I still used to make people throw up everyone Roller Coaster Tycoon, and then I'd feel really sick afterwards. It was such a good game. Get the ingredients ready for before dinner starts. All right, on it. Let's go. Take me back to the sushi shop. Shh, what is wrong with me? I can't speak today. You're a weird, you were a weird child. Oh, trust me, I know. You didn't notice when I told you I used to fucking collect envelopes and lick the man? Like, hello? What do you mean? You think I didn't know that? Bancho, how are the preparations coming along? Hmm, I think we're mostly set. That's good, here's for a great evening. Bancho, basically, I have a bit of a, like, a praise kink. I really like it when people tell me I did a good job, or that I'm a good boy. I caught way more fish than you asked for, so I was wondering if you were gonna praise me at all. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're here to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. Wait, what? So I have to dive and fish all day and then run the- okay. God, I love a good praise. Trust me. Yeah, me too. Good boy. Thanks, guys. Thank you. I don't understand. Cobra told me that there would be somebody here to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed is to cook. Well, this is news to me, man. And who else is there for that but you? Poor Dave, man. They're running us ragged. I've never worked at a restaurant before. <laughs> Tari, man. <laughs> I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. Okay, let's do this. Any primers? Any primers, chat? Open the ingredients below. Press 4 to check ingredients. Here, you can check your fish, crop, sources, and all other materials you have. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more info. Hey, cool. 
uh, press C to close. All right. Any primers? Now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. Okay. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. I'm loving the music in this game, by the way. How good is the music, guys? Okay, new recipes need to be added. Okay. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier, so try registering that to the menu. All right. Add menu. Ooh. Ooh, let's add, um... Let's add the long... Let's add the long, thin bat fish. Uh, number added, three max. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Convenient. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you'll have to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. Oh. You can also enhance the flavor of the dishes, so try it out when you have enough ingredients. Use the ingredients you caught to fill out the menu as much as you can. All right, okay, I get it, I get it. Um, you can change the menu every day, okay. I can't believe video games existed when Koji was a baby. Well, thank God they did. Let's do... Um, well, we're trying to make a hundred, we're trying to make a hundred coins, right? So let's just put on our most expensive things. Uh, I wish I could add a little bit of spice to them, you know, but um, I can't because I don't think we have any ingredients to make things delicious yet. Uh, so we have those sell for four gold. We have four of them. These sell for six gold. We have four of them. 6, 12, 18, 24. Let's do the blue tang. Disgusting! How long are you gonna stand there talking? Excuse me, what? Cobra man, you're so fucking rude. You flew me out here telling me I was just gonna do a little bit of fishing and now I'm running your sushi restaurant, man. Give me a cup of green tea to quench my first. Have you perhaps poured green tea before? No, only soft drinks, I think. God, Dave is really sweet. I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Pour Cobra a green tea. I really don't want to do that, but I'm gonna have to do that, I think. Pour the right amount? What? Don't call me bad! It's my first time! Not bad, not bad. <laughs> As expected, Bancho's green tea is quite something. Mmm, that tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? Right, wait until the cooking is done. Oh, look at Bancho go in the kitchen. Come over to where I am and take this food. Okay. I'm on my way. You can dash when serving food. Wait, is this Valorant? You shift to move quickly. Don't forget to watch your sen sentinel. Stamina. Sentinel? Stamina. Oh, we have stamina. Okay. Hello. You sent the package last week, you say. What in the world? Let me check on that. Bro, I just brought your dinner over. Are you joking? The food can't be reused, reused so we'll have to throw it out. Let's just eat it. Bancho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Mm. Well, what? why can't... Has Dave the Diver even eaten all day today? Like, can we not eat this? Koji, if a random proposed to you via Twitch whispers, would you accept? How many gifted? De it depends what they were offering. Is there an offer? Or is it just like a completely free proposal with no incentives I didn't get offered any gifted Heather it's entirely up to you man I can't speak for you and your current situation however 
I think my advice would probably be to politely decline, but hey, it's neither here nor there. It's up to you. Everything looks about ready. Hmm. I haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kind of nervous. Don't forget to press E after filling the menu for, bu for business to begin. Okay. Customers will order dishes from the menu. Don't forget to register dishes for the menu before the... Okay. But we already did this, right? Um... Nori Maki, sushi made with seaweed, vinegar, and wasabi. Wait, like, it's just seaweed sushi with, I've never had that before. Mmm, that sounds kind of good. Green tea is only one dollar. Holy. We're open for business, let's go. Come on in, everyone. Oh, wait, what's this over here? What's that? It's like a green carrot. Oh, you won't be able to produce food if you run out of wasabi. Oh, it's wasabi. Grind and refill the wasabi before it runs out. Mmm, wasabi. Press W to grind and refill the wasabi. Huh? Oh my god, wait, this is kind of stressful. Wait, this is like plate up. Hey, this is cool. I wasn't expecting all this, to be honest. I got it on the wasabi, don't worry, Bancho. I understand the assignment. Yo. We've already made, um, like, 16 coins back. We need 100. Hey, I'm loving this, chat. This is great. Oh, I have to click fast to clean up, I think. Oh, you want a green tea? I got you. Oh! What a poor man! Sorry, I wasn't calling the customers poor. I was saying it was a good poor. Nice! Uh, oh, wait, you're getting impatient. I got you. Sorry. Mmm, I like that person says. Mmm, me too. I really want sushi now. This place seems different. Yeah, also, this place is a total vibe, man. Look at the view, chat. Look at the view. And we've got like the little neon lights everywhere. We've got some speakers going. Oh my god. Someone is barbecuing. One of my neighbors must be having a barbecue because all I can smell is like smoky coals and it smells really good. Maybe order sushi from Uber Eats. Yo, Truja, that's actually a really good idea. But I think me and Abby are cooking a roast dinner tonight. Oh, I need to actually speak to Abby. Maybe tomorrow we'll order some sushi from Uber Eats. That's a good idea. Sorry, guys. I just got text Abby. I just realized. Um... Okay. Chat, can you please remind me to just check my phone and see if Abby's messaged me in like five minutes? Because I know I'll forget. Because I'm absolutely useless with that. I get really uh, immersed and lost in streaming. Also, today's score, five stars. You earned five Artisan's Flame. We made 80 gold. We've nearly recovered all our, like, debt losses. Um... Almost got 100 in the first day. It was a really, really good day today. That was an amazing first day. How much of that do we keep? What's up, Chloe? Welcome in. How you doing today? Good to see ya. Phew, work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. Yeah, Dave, long day for you, man. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Try a little harder next time. Bancho, are you fucking... Are you having a laugh, mate? I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment, hee <laughs> hee. A man should not feel gratification from simple compliments. <laughs> Bancho. You don't know me. Just a tiny little good job today would make my day. Uh, but what you're doing is not helping. It's making me really not like you. Yeah, yeah. Alright. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. Guys, Dave is so cute. How can anyone... Be mean to Dave. Look at him right now. 
Good job streaming today, Koji. Thanks, Doc. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you. I love your t-shirt kind of match what they're wearing. Wait, true. I got those, like, coastal sea vibe colors on today. Great first day. This was fun. This is a really fun game. I like it. What do you reckon, chat? PPL Express. People. Pleaser. Lover. <gasps> Octopi! Huh? What's going on? Oh my god! Wait, this isn't cozy! What? Is that all the... What is... What? I want to play this game so bad now, but I brought like eight games in the Steam sale. Taru, I'll tell you what. If you DM me your Steam ID, I will literally gift you this game. It's the least I could do for everything you've ever done for me, man. I would, it'd be my honor. Just DM it to me. Ellie is calling. I don't know who Ellie is. Are you the man who's diving around here? Yeah, I think so. Tsk. I was expecting a more professional looking guy. I can hear you, you know. Honestly, I feel the same. I brought like 20 games in the Steam Summer Sale. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Wait, Ellie's kind of, kind of cute. Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the local graduate school. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Anomaly alert! Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? Bro, Dave is... Dave almost looks like a little seal, all geared up. Dave is just really cute. I'd like to study the ecology of this blue hole. Get me some agar and some red starfish first. Alright, Ellie. Anything for you. I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one of each, so get me two of each. Your tone makes me want to refuse. Yo, Dave, good for you for standing up for yourself, man! Hmm, I've got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. I love how you tell us about the rewards when we had to ask about it. Uh, re reward? I wasn't refusing, I'm just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry, don't dally. Dilly dally. Okay, red ecological data. Guys, I have a really five gifted reward? <laughs> You can use your phone to access various types of content. Check your current missions and more. Game settings can be accessed from the phone. Check your phone. Oh, wait, chat, you're talking about my actual phone, aren't you? Okay, Abby hasn't replied, I don't think, but thank you, guys. Give me two secs, guys. I'm actually just gonna... I'm gonna go run down and just speak to Abby quickly, because if Abby's... We want to cook a roast dinner together tonight, and I really don't want her to cook it on her own, because I'll feel really bad. At... So let me just go check she hasn't started cooking or something. I'll be right back, guys. Give me two secs. God, all I can smell is barbecue chat. It smells so incredibly good. Okay, all right. Anyway, guys, let's carry on with this game. I'm really, really enjoying this game. But also, I want the people to know that we're like really into the idea of DVD. I don't think it's just like a one-off thing where I'm like, oh, I only want to play DVD today or today only. I just, I, I've been wanting to play DVD for months, to be honest with you. There's been so many things I want to stream, and I'm also not streaming really long hours. Um. So, right, we need to make 20 gold today. Wait, it's, it still says make 100 gold, but I, I think we need to make 20 more. Red ecological data, we've got to acquire these things. But surely I need to go and catch fish as well, right? I feel like I must need to actually catch fish as well. Lagoon tiger fish. Oh, that one... Okay. Oh god, it's so, like, I don't know what it is. Every time I, like, I don't personally really like the sea in real life. It scares me, but... Oh my god, what was that? Sleepy toy hammer, what the? Um... How am 
I supposed to know where to find these things, though? <gasps> what the? Come here, little shit. Oh. No. Let's go to sleep. Sleep. Oh, God. This is a battle. Sleep. Hi, soybean. Wait. How is this? How many times, man? Is this not, like, catchable? I don't... It's got to be catchable. Like, why would it be in the game? Okay. What, like, there's no health bar or anything. Chat, if I dedicate my entire dive to this puffer fish and it's not even catchable, then I've really screwed up my day here. Starry Puffer, let's go! Okay, we're actually looking for something really important though, guys. We're looking for the red stuff. What on earth is that? I'm so sorry. Oh my god, there's the red things I need to find. Oh wait, don't hold shift, don't hold shift. Oh god, this is really brutal. I don't really like it, but I need to do this. Oh, look at your cute little face. I'm so sorry, you really don't deserve this. You really don't deserve it, but I need to play the game. I don't think I'd do very well on a vegan playthrough in this particular game. I think the business would just go bust and everyone would hate me and I'd have to go home. You just silly hammered a pufferfish to death, you monster. Congratulations. <laughs> Thanks, man. Hey, you guys told me to play this game, remember? Bro, my tools absolutely suck. Cut, I mean, come on, man. Like, at what point is this going to be over? I voted for D&D, actually. All right, valid, fair enough. This is nuts, man. How much health? No! What? Green hump head parrotfish. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that a real name of a fish? <gasps> oh my god, I just found extra oxygen. We can continue the dive. Wait. Let's do it. Let's continue the dive. This is fun. Um, Wait, go do it again? Oh, crap. Okay. Thanks, guys. Oh, what's that? Ah, it hurts. Oh, I need gloves. I need special gloves. Oh, I got a wood. I got a wood. Oh, wow. You can farm that fish for two. Yeah, nice. Okay. Oh, what's that? Oh. Copper ore? Cool. Don't! What? What is this? Slow-mo. Slow-mo. Holding. Holding. I don't know if I got all the species I needed. Fuck. You know, for the red ecological data thing? I don't... Oh, what the hell is that? <gasps> aggressive! Aggressive! No, I can't take... I think if we take a hit, chat, it, like, takes our oxygen away. Oh, shugs, man. What do we got ourselves into, chat? Easy. Absolutely. Yo, Titan Triggerfish? 
absolutely defecated on, man. It's my first time as well. You need another starfish? Oh. Damn it. I didn't see another starfish. Oh, eel. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Wait, there's one there. No way. I don't it's orange though. I don't know if that's going to work. All right, perfect. That was a really Yeah, he's dead, your oxygen man. Guys, I'm chilling on the boat. What's the problem here? We got the green hump head. We were down under for six minutes. That's a world record. We obtained seven ingredients and four fish, I think. I think that's what that means. Oh, wait. I only got one starfish. Oh. Oh! <gasps> the starry puffer sells for 180 bucks? Oh my. Oh my god. Thanks, Asian Diva. Hi, Just James UK. Welcome Hello. home, man. Did you get to loosen up yesterday? Mm. I saw a lot of nasty fish. It won't be easy to go any deeper. I did notice that the fish in the blue hole have an odd violent streak. Perhaps something puts them on edge. Yeah, probably humans coming in there and killing them all! Speaking of which, why don't you take a gun in addition to the harpoon? A gun? I have a friend who's knowledgeable. Knowledgeable. <laughs> knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you. Yo, what's up, Duff? Wow, Cobra, it's been a while. Who is the goofy-looking guy next to you? Bro. Are you joking? How are you gonna talk about me like that? Sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing I've said to a stranger. I'm Dave, a professional diver. Oh, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger, sorry. Interesting. I thought divers were athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. Hey, listen, Duff. I don't know who the fuck you think you are. People who live in glass houses. Uh -huh. Exactly, Dave. So what's this about? I'd like to get straight to the point. I've begun a very interesting business. Ha 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 ha. And now I'm in need of some weapons, Duff. I need your help. Is Duff an American name chat? Because I've only ever heard the word Duff used as Duff Beer from The Simpsons. That's the only thing I can think of. Season 2 of Straw Stella just ended anyway. I'll give you a listen. Thanks, Duff. Really appreciate your ears, man. I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. The terrain and ecology inside it changes every time you go inside. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when bought out. I've never met anyone named Duff. Okay. I've heard of duffel. Wait, duffel like a duffel bag? Hillary Duff. True, but that's a surname. So that doesn't, I guess surnames can be anything. I'd like you to make us a weapon that can be used inside. Yeah. Duff Goldman? I don't know who that is. That is rather interesting. You've piqued my interest as a weapon researcher, you could yeah. say. My hypothesis is my hop. Oh, I, I pressed skip. This will be especially true of guns, which have precision parts. We'll have to get the materials from the sea ourselves. Huh. You'll have to prove yourself as a diver to this Master Duff. Wait, did you just call yourself Master Duff? I'm not sure why I should have to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think I'll need one rope and one scrap iron. Okay. If you run out of oxygen midway, you'll only be able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. I love that. I love games with, like, really high risk reward factors. I, I genuinely find it really fun. If you exceed your weight limit, you'll slow down. If you exceed an even higher amount, you won't be able to carry any more. Press escape to organize. What? Wait. Organize? Uh... Maybe when I'm in the water? Okay. Our to-do list is find... We need another red starfish. We've only got one out of two. We need to find rope and scrap iron. Oh, wait. Zero to 130 meters. Zero to 50 meters. Oh, it says how deep you need to go to find these things. Okay. All right, cool. 
Let's do it. Let's let's dive again. So we need to find rope, scrap iron, and two red starfish. But we also need to make sure. Oh, green hump head. It breaks apart and eats coral. We already killed one of those. So we need to find iron, scrap iron, rope. Oh, red starfish. Let's go. That's what we needed. Okay, rope, scrap, iron, but also, chat, we need to just be, oh my god, honestly, one of my neighbors is cooking a barbecue and it just smells so good, it's making me absolutely starving. Let's try going to the right a little bit. I am carrying a lot of wood, which, it might just be a junk item, we might need to get rid of it, I don't know. Hey, what happened to, like, my other cool weapons? What? Look at that tiny little, um, seahorse. That's so cute. Oh, O2. You lose everything every dive. I didn't realize I was gonna lose all my cool weapons on dives. That really sucks. Wait. Wait, why is it like instantly using the oxygen? What if I wanted to save that for later? That's a cool fish. Let's catch one of those. Oh! Oh no, you're actually really quick. Come here, please. It was you, right? Oh, what a shot. Quick scope. Uh, scrap iron. Scrap iron. <gasps> nice. Mediterranean parrotfish. Pog. Okay. Chat, remember. If we see a, a blowfish, it's worth like 180 gold. So they are very pog. Yo, what's up, Dad Talk? How are we doing today? Good to see ya. Hello, hello. Oh, whiffed. Oh, you, you can't like shoot directly up. Oh, what a shot! Come here. No, I'm so sorry. Oh no, that sucks. Critical depth. I'd imagine that the critical... Critical death, yeah. Oh my god. You lose? Wait, shit, no! No, I didn't think I was actually gonna use it, no! I thought I was unlocking it, no. Oh, chat. I thought I was unlocking a new place to be able to escape from. There was literally a treasure chest right next to me that I didn't get to open. That is going to live with me forever now. You actually brought them back. I guess I expected too little of you. It seems like everyone around here does. This should do for now. I'll give you a reward as promised since you helped me do my research. Yo, Hated, thank you for the follow. Also, if you're new, I, please don't forget to follow. I'd really appreciate that. The sudden ecological changes in this region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue need to need your services. Add my number. Yo, we got rewards and we got Ellie's number? Goth 70 boy, gold? Quick. We're not going broke anymore. Olive oil and soy sauce. Nice. Oh, Dave, you collected 100 gold. Great job. This should be enough to repair what's broken. Give me some time. Those repairs need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming. Dave, you're so cute. Eleanor, thank you so much for the 21 months. I really appreciate it. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. I hope you're having a lovely start to your week. Okay. We did have a rubbish second dive, but we still got some food. We got some... We got the red starfish. Oh, and we got cooking ingredients. Nice. Thumbs up. Back for another shift at the sushi shop. Sushi shop. What's this if I do this? Oh, it's storage. Oh, so maybe you can store other types of guns and stuff in here. Okay, cool. This is not a dating game. Surely at some point there's going to be some options to date. What's up, Paul Unplugged? How are we doing? I'm doing good, thank you for asking. What's up, Kylag? What's up, Caitla? Hello, Quasson. True. 
Exactly, Cherry. Right, let's open. Uh, oh no, let's do the menu. Um, add to menu. Where is our blowfish? That thing is gonna make us some serious money. What? Where is it? Huh? What? Wait, uh, auto supply, enhance, swap, add ingredients. Okay. Oh my god, that is gonna make us so much money, guys. The green hump head is worth 160 gold, I think. And what if I season it? Oh, so when you... Enhance it, it becomes worth more gold, and it looks like it, like, customer satisfaction is through the roof, man. But I can't enhance that right now. <laughs> Juniper, hi Juniper. First stream I've been able to catch in a while. I've missed everyone, Coach Heart. Hey, we missed you too. Welcome back. So good to see you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. You lose all the materials you don't use. What? Wait, really? Wait, wait, hold on. If you overstock your menu... Oh! Wait, so... Wait, okay, wait. If I... So if I don't sell 10 out of 10 of these things, I lose it. So what's auto-supply? Let's, let's, let's start again. Auto supply. Wait! Where's everything gone? Oh no! I think I've just deleted all my food. What? Like what? How, how is that? It said you were discarding it. Oh no, chat, I just deleted all my good catches. I don't think we even have anything like worth money left. Fuck! I don't think like we can go back and reload other saves, guys. Why can't I see what it says at the bottom? Even... Wait! How do I load that save? Why can't I scroll down on this? Wait, I... Guys, there actually might be hope if I ult F4. There might be hope. What the fuck is this? Um, oh no, what a nightmare, man. Right, okay, so now we know. If we add anything to the menu, and then remove it, it dis discards it and deletes it. Okay, load.
I'm going to try the 1816 because I can always just try again with the 1811, I think. Oh my god, perfect! Let's go! Oh my god, amazing, man. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Okay. Oh, thank god. That was actually devastating. Okay, so we've learned a lot from this chat. We've learned that firstly, if we just like remove stuff from the menu, we need to make sure we're not discarding it. Like, I think once you add it to the menu, you, if you get rid of it, you lose it. Also, if we don't sell out the stocks, like if we... If we don't sell out everything we put on the menu, then we lose it. Goth boy, click. Oh, hey, hi, hello. Can't believe we'd cheat on my Queen Abby like this. <laughs> hello, B Turbulent. Thank you so much for the 25 months. I really appreciate it. Thank you. That is a really long time. Also, unless I play five dates, I guess that's never going to happen again. Just so we know. Uh, okay. That one, right? 11. Evening on the boat. Yeah, okay, wait. That one sounds perfect, to be honest. Evening on the boat. That means we've probably done both our fishing trips. Oh! Hmm, you actually brought them back. I guess I expected too little of you. Okay, amazing. All right, we get Ellie's number. We get the rewards. Perfect, right? We've got the 100 beans. We've repaired Bancho Sushi. We've saved the day. Everyone loves us. And if they don't, fuck them because we deserve to be loved. Let's do this. All right, to the sushi restaurant. This game is great, by the way, chat. Honestly. I hope you guys are enjoying watching it, because I'm really, really enjoying playing it. This has been amazing. Right. Oh. Guys, I just opened for business without op adding to the menu. What's wrong with my brain? Is it... I think it's okay. Are the meds wearing off already? Probably. Asian Diva, I will, uh, Kronk, yo, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. I will enhance the fish next time, I think, guys. Oh, wait. Oh my god. We're enhancing the, the hump head, the really expensive one. Okay, pretty cool, to be fair, pretty cool. Yeah, annoyingly cool, okay, cool. Wait, that's so... F that's so sad. That was so sad. Is this enhanced now? Okay, nice. <gasps> 69 customer satisfaction. Yo, it was meant to be. They're even licking their lips about it. They're so happy. They're licking their lips with the 69 satisfaction. Delicious. Let's go. Tonight's menu is Pog. Perfect pour incoming. Sheesh! Unbelievable. I think I just got a tip for that because it was so cool. All right. Give me the food, man. Let's do it. Nice. Holy, calm down, man. Relax. Oh my god, another perfect pour. Let's go. Hmm. 
Nice. Wait, this guys, this game's so good. I can see this game being really addictive though, because it's kind of got that Stardew Valley aspect where it's like, okay, one more day. One more day, one more day, you know? All right, one more shift, one more fishing run. Wow, this is good. They, they're saying like, wow, this is so good. I'm salivating. Wait, Dave, what are you doing, man? Oh, oh, sorry. I was looking at Dave in the corner. I didn't realize the food was ready. Another perfect pour incoming. What? I found my calling. I need to just pour green teas and like miso soups all day long. Amazing. What a shift, man. Aliska, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Hello, welcome raiders. What's up, everyone? Games Bandicoot, thank you for the follow. Han, thank you for the follow. My name is Koji. My pronouns are he and him, and I'm playing uh, Dave the Diver for the first time today. I hope you, thank you so much for shouting out Aliska. If you guys aren't already following Aliska, go follow Aliska right now. Aliska is an amazing, super cozy streamer, and you guys will love the vibes over there, I promise. Um, welcome in everyone. I'm playing Dave the Diver for the first time today. I don't know what you guys were playing. What were you guys? Dave the Diver! You guys are playing Dave the Diver too? I hope you guys had a really good time. I'm sure you did. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. This game is so good. Seriously. So we made 123 gold today. We got five stars. Um, everything's great, I think. B and W snapper sushi. Did we not sell any of our super expensive sushi tonight, though? The one with 69 satisfaction. Um, welcome in raiders. Yeah, honestly, this game has been really fun. Thanks, Bandicoot. I hope you had a great stream, Alice. Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Right, Doctor Bacon. Are you Dave by any chance? Yes. What is it, sir? Dave is always so polite to everyone. I'm always right about these things. Haha. Right. Ha. Nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the sea people civilization. Mm. The sea people civilization? I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky to have an expert like me to tell you about them? Here we go. What's up, Soaring? The sea people civilization lives in legends. They are said to have occupied... Oh! They worship fish and had gills allowing them to live underwater. They lived in the depths, allowing them to flourish without any concern for invasions by other civilizations, but sudden changes to the sea brought and brought about their abrupt downfall. What? This is amazing. Not their downfall. Their downfall their downfall <laughs> their downfall isn't amazing. But the the lore is really cool. That's about all there is to the story. Everyone thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course. But proof that they were real was found right in the vicinity of this place. This is an amazing find, one that could turn the whole academic world upside down. An ancient civilization under the sea. You'd only see such things in comic books or games. Okay, chat. This is so interesting, and this reminded me of a conversation we had uh, at dinner the other day. I went out for dinner with Frey and a couple of people, and Frey said to us, if you could do, if you could go, like, if you could explore the, like, the unexplored in the sea, or go to space, which one would you do? Like, you could go as deep as you wanted in the sea, you could, like, explore everything, and you were guaranteed it was going to be safe, and you'd be okay, and everything was, like, going to be fine. Or you could go to space, which one would you choose? And it's really interesting, because I said to Frey, like, I hate the sea. Like, the idea of pitch black darkness deep down in sea terrifies me. I'm good, Earth. Honestly, I was like, I hate the sea. It's too scary. I would go to space. But I said to Frey, one thing I'd love to do, I technically you could definitely do this in space as well, right? But imagine going like really to un like you're talking no human. I guess it's the same for space though. No human has ever seen these parts of the sea. It's completely unexplored. You could like discover stuff like this. I said to I said to Frey, what if you uncovered an ancient like human civilization that currently no one knows about? That would be so amazing. See, oh, I don't, I don't know how to say Le Leviathans. I know what you're talking about, though, because it's in frickin' Subnautica. Leviathans. 
Bro, have you seen those huge squids? Those squids that are like bigger than ships? Yeah, you got it. Thanks, Hev. I personally would go to space, and you could technically find civilizations in space too, but it would be so amazing to discover, like, um, a whole ancient civilization no one ever knew about under the sea. Like, that'd be so crazy. Colossal squid! Hi, Joseph. My favorite creature. Bro, those things are scary. Oh, something in my eyelash. Those things really scare me. Han Solo, thank you for the follow, by the way. I appreciate it. Like in space, you're just encountering rocks. But you could go to, like, anywhere in space, I guess. You could find a civilization in space. My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that, found that it is from no known civilization. Dated around 1500 years ago, there was no civilizations in these parts back then. Interesting, but what business do you have with me? My assistant's cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out, and he won't be around for a good while. That's why I'd like you to help me. Oh. My assistant told me that the artifact was found 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. Bro. We're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can. Sorry to interrupt the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dave. Of course we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Yeah, ha, 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 ha. Wait, you're not the one that has to do all the work, man. We don't have the time to swim around searching for artifacts. Think about it. If an underwater, an underwater civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. Bant's show sushi will be bursting at the seams. Yo, Cobra. I don't like your I don't like your outlook on the world, man. But it business-wise, I guess it makes sense. Isn't that lucky? I won't be asking you to work for free. I'll be upgrade. I'll upgrade your diving suit you're wearing for free. Okay. Enhanced diving suit. You'll be able to venture deeper. Essential for exploration. Yeah. That's what we wanted, chat, because I want to go deep. These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Techn technological advancements are amazing, eh? Let's install the iDiver app. Okay. All right, cool. That's actually really cool. Hyper JMS. Thank you for the follows, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, the iDiver app allows you to enhance various diving equipment. Upgrade equipment with the money you make at the sushi bar and elsewhere, and explore deeper waters. Oh. Nice! I'll install the app for you, so unlock your phone first. Alright. Open phone. Run iDiver. Ooh. Wait! Oh, oh, free! Free upgrades! Depth limit 80! Um, Wait, so what else? We have quite a lot of money. I don't... Oh shit, was I supposed to like take my time on that and pick a specific upgrade? I hope I wasn't. I think it was... No, diving suit, yeah. Is I don't really understand, chat. I have money in the top corner. You can't see it because it's behind my camera. But I have 173 gold up there, but I don't... Is that all mine? Well, let's find out. I'm gonna upgrade my air tank. Nice. Let's go. I don't need to update the upgrade the cargo box yet. I don't think because I haven't even used it yet. All right, we're going in for another dive. We've got upgraded. Um, we've got upgraded suit. We have got upgraded oxygen. Oh wait, you guys saying I should have brought cargo too? You've been overweight already. Wait, have I? Oh, if I go back up, it counts as a dive though, right? Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, we'll do that next time. Right, so I'm looking for... Wow, what are these? Oh, whiffing. Oh my god, I'm whiffing. <gasps> Fried egg jellyfish! Is it gonna sting me? Oh, fried egg jellyfish, let's go! Let's get another one of these before we move. Wow, that extra oxygen is actually going to be really helpful, I think. Right. There is something down here. Oh, rope! Yeah, we need ope. Ope? <laughs> oh, crap. Ow. Oh, shit. Oh. 
Oh, fuck. Nice. Please. We need rope and we needed uh, scrap iron, right? Where is my... Oh, here's my quest. Okay, we're looking for scrap iron and we're looking for an artifact at 70 meters. Okay, let's do it. Where are we right now? 21 meters. Oh my god. We're going deep. Hopefully we can find some more oxygen on the way down. That'd be really helpful. Oh, what's that? Something cool. Black vinegar? I'll take that. Oh, shit! Aggressive! Stay back! Nice shot, man. Nice shot, man. Sorry, I was looking- I was taking a, a breather to look at chat then. I didn't realize it was... Nice. Red lionfish. Poggers. Are you aggressive? No. Well, come here then. Oh, that feels mean. This game looks fun. Hi, SGW. It is. This game's really fun. Hi, Claudia. This is a very cozy game, and it is actually really fun. I can definitely see myself getting a little bit addicted to this one, for sure. Okay, Hev, man. Okay, Hev. You had to find a way that you could turn this on me. You had to, man. God, this fish has a lot of health. I'm just, like, wasting everything. Yo, Sleepy, thank you for the follow. Uh, I'm Axe, thank you for the follow. Oh! Yo, Akko! Let's go! Thank you so much for the raid! Hey, I hope you had the most amazing time at... I hope you had the most amazing time at TwitchCon. I don't know... Wait, is it Disney right... I'm over... I'm over... I'm overwhelmed. I'm overbearing. I'm carrying too much. Um... Wait, he was doing an IRL stream at Disney? God, I'm so jealous. Well, I'm sure he's not watching then, but I really appreciate the raid either way. It was the most scuffed stream ever. Hey, I don't know. I feel like my every single stream, even my proudest stream ever, was really scuffed, so I, I'm not going to make any comment. But hello, my name is Koji. Uh, throw the copper. I didn't realize you could throw stuff. Oh, it's really heavy. Yeah. Oh, discard. Okay, let's get rid of the copper. Good idea. Thank you. Who said that? Wait, I'm still over... I'm still over. The Dusky Grouper is taking up 9 kilograms! Told him to go have fun with his friends. Um, Gospel, welcome I in, quit. Raiders. My name is Koji. My Hi, pronouns Coach are he Trump. and him. I'm playing a really cute game now, right now, called uh, Dave the Diver. It's my first time playing, and it's really fun. Perzat, Oki, Anna, Eri, Penel Penel Penelope, uh, Aldice, Hey Parker, thank you for the follows, guys. I really appreciate it. And Diana, thank you so much for the 33 months. I really... Oh, you little shit! Oh god, chat! This could be the end of me! Oh no! Oh fuck! I'm over... I'm over... Shit! Oh my god, thank god. Oh my god, I thought it was over for us. We haven't actually died yet. That was gonna be our first death. Um, but yeah, if you guys would love to, like, to stick around, we'd love to have you. I'm just playing this game for the first time. It's... It's really good. It's been really fun. It's very cozy. It's a very cozy game, but it's also just really fun. I'm really enjoying it. Uh, the Girl Painted, thank you for the follows. Appreciate it. Hello, Lenray. Yeah, the game's really pretty. Great music, Goth great boy, art quick. style, cozy. What hey, more could coach, you ask for, really? I started my new job today. I'm Yo. very tired, though. Ha ha. Honestly, congratulations, first and foremost, on your new job. And secondly... So valid, man. Starting a new job is honestly up there with, like, moving house in terms of exhaustion. I totally get it. Every time I'd start a new job, I, rem like, I remember the exhaustion. Like, it's so information overload, meeting everyone, trying to remember names. That's okay, man. I'm, I, I hope you had a good first day, though. Skylar, thank you so much for the 14 months. I really appreciate it. And I hope the job is everything you'd want and more, man. I have thalassophobia, but this game somehow doesn't trigger it. Is that... Is that the fear of, like, holes in, like, sponges and, like, that stuff? What is that? 
It's looking very nice. Wait, it's all fixed up. Oh, fear of deep water. Oh, that's tripophobia. Fear of the deep. Well, I'm glad the game doesn't trigger it because that would not be good. No, no, I'm not outside. This is actually my office. <laughs> this is just my, this is my office, my streaming room. Uh, if you want to change the interior, the interior menu is below. Wait, we can even customize the interior? It's not a moss wall. It's not a moss wall. It's a living wall. It's a... You guys are the worst, man. No. Oh, God, chat. You're, look at you. You're all the same. Same jokes, man. As Dr. Bacon said, if the remains of sea people are found here, customers will indeed come. But this area is kind of remote, so I think I'll need a way to advertise the store until then. It's impossible to attract customers without publicity. True. Social social media app named Cookster. Good idea, Dave. Social media people use... Yeah. I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. All right, Bancho. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographs. Why can't it just do both, man? Like, why? Like, mm. come on. Even so, isn't it better to use it than keep people ignorant of your food? Mm. Exactly, Dave. Yo, Dave is coming in and running this shit. Making an account is simple, so let's try that out. Okay. Nice. All right, we've unlocked the app Cookster. Raise your rating in Cookster. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlock conditions of new ratings can be seen in the app. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. I like that. Also, customizing the interior is... <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, that light wood is so much nicer than both of these. Um, all right. So we got the, the normal wood table, which kind of looks like Beach Shack vibes. Mm. Oriental Modern is, like, cooler. But I feel like it looks a little bit out of place. But let's just apply it and see what... Oh, it does look cool, though. That's so Dave. Hi, Sofros Hall. You're so right about that. Yo, European Blue. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to SGWD. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, chairs. Ooh, rattan bar chair. That's... Oh, wait, we have to buy that. No. See, chat, I can... All I'm seeing with all this stuff is endless grinding in this game. There's so much to play for. You can even change the ceiling. Oh, oh that's so pretty, man. Okay, we need to unlock some of this stuff. Can get little plants as well. Oh wait, I own that one. Oh wait, and the plant. The plant was free. Wait, no, it's not. The plant's 50 gold. But we got the painting. We'll take that. Okay, I definitely prefer the modern one. Is this game still on sale? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the Steam Summer Sale is still a couple more days at least. Um... I did not mean to do that. Oh. Um, until the 13th. This The grinds come at good... Wait, the grinds come at good times in the game too. I never feel overwhelmed with the tasks like farming in Stardew. That's really good to hear, actually. Okay. Wow, look at all these ingredients we've got. So wait, we can... We can sell our ingredients. What is it? Who, who am I selling that to? I don't really, I don't really understand that. But how much was it? I'm not gonna lie. I brought this game a couple of weeks ago. I'm so sorry. I don't remember how much it was. Maybe someone in chat can tell. Okay, let's. Oh, I can't enhance that. Let's add it to the menu anyway. I think. 
yeah. Let's add it to the menu. We only have one. Let's do it. Let's add... Oh, we can enhance this with the fried egg jellyfish. Nice. Oh, it's around 15 pounds. So, like, yeah. 18 to 20 dollars or something. What just happened? Oh, enhanced cutscene. <laughs> Wait, how do I go for my afternoon dive? These cutscenes are so cool. Love it. Wait, what? Chat, I can literally feel myself just falling in love with this game, man. This is so great. Enhance complete. Let's go. Uh, guys, I need to go pee really quick. Um, I will be right back. If you have not taken your meds or vitamins yet, it's appropriate time to do so. You should definitely go do that in case you forget again. I'll be right back. Tune might just buy it for that. What's up, Umi? Yeah, the music in this game has been so good so far. Um, I have to go in like 15 minutes, chat. So I'm thinking let's do one more dive. Let's go do our afternoon dive. Like, how do I do that, though? Time skip. I don't want to do that. Oh, exit. Oh, there we go. Wait, exit. It's looking good in here, though. Okay, chat, we're gonna have to play this game again tomorrow. This is so good. Ain't no way we're not playing this again tomorrow. Okay. Uh, let's... How do I... Oh, it's on the app. I need to upgrade my storage, don't I, guys? Um... So that stuff's all in my storage already, right? But I want to... Oh, I want to upgrade my... That's it. Um, cargo box. There we go. I thought it just meant the box on the boat, guys. That's why I didn't upgrade it. I didn't understand it was like what I'm carrying with me. Alright, one last dive. It's so cute. Yeah, it's really cute. I really want to find the artifact, to be honest with you guys. The most important things to find right now are the artifact... And the scrap iron. Because um, I think, like, regardless, we have enough. <gasps> Dolphin cutscene! Oh my god! A dolphin? It seems to be asking me to follow. Should I try and follow? Yes! Follow the dolphin now! Go! Wait, you're going so fast. I don't want to... Oh, it's okay. Maybe the dolphin's going to take me... Th oh, there's some oxygen there. Wish you could, like, pin stu ping, ping stuff so I could, like, come back and find it. Oh, scrap iron! <gasps> oh, my God! A pink dolphin is caught in the net. 
Oh my god, don't worry, I'm gonna save ya. Oh my god. Sweet little pink dolphin, be free. Oh my god, I love this game so much. Oh, what's that on the floor? Oh my god, and there's a there's a loot box up there, man. No, <laughs> all you cared about was the scrap iron, be honest. Heather, man. I didn't even know dolphins had mates. Wait, oh my god, I'm loving this. Okay, we got a pearl. There's a red starfish over here. And something cool, something cool, something cool. Oxygen. Definitely gonna take that. Okay. Let's go looking for... We need to find the artifact, guys. That's all we've got left to find. It's probably going to be a bit deeper, right? Oh, I just pulled out my headphones. That fish made me jump, man. Oh, squid! Squid! Oh, shit! I've been inked! Fuck, okay. Alright, I didn't know the squid inked like that. I'm going to get one of these squids. I have to, guys. We've got spare oxygen if we need it. There's a pearl. Okay, we're at 67 meters. Uh, 69. Nice. 69 meters depth right now. <gasps> what? No. No. Shot. It's like Subnautica. we got a little... um. Guys, we have a little... Oh, my God. We're popping off, man. Okay. So, we've got... We've refreshed our oxygen supplies. We have backup oxygen if we need it. And... We have, um... A little super fast movement thing. Which is really cool. Oh, is that the artifact? Let's go. What's happening? This is such a... Is that an eyeball? Is that... What is that? It's like a dragon. Oh, is it one of those? It's one of those squids we were talking about earlier. Oh, what were they called again, chat? Oh, no. Dave's got scared. He wants to go back to the boat. Sorry, Dave. <gasps> what the heck? Shit. Guys. Nah, we can't. We can't fuck with that right now. Can we? It's juked! I'm... I'm fucking him up! No! Shit! Fuck! Shit! Juked! Bitch! Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me! Whoa! Whoa, ch whoa! Please chill, please chill, please chill, please chill! <gasps> Ow! Oh fuck, guys, I'm actually gonna die! Fuck! Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me! Yes! Get me out! <sighs> that was fucking horrifying. Guys, you gotta remember, if I die, I can only keep one item. This was like the most successful dive of my life. We found so much cool stuff. History said you attack that thing first? No. No, chat. 
That thing came at me. You saw it. You actually managed to bring it back. I expected you to quietly expire in the depths, you could say. Yeah, you could say that, Duff. Good one, man. Oh, basic underwater rifle. Bro, if we had that, this would never have been a problem in the first place. Duff's weapon shop on your phone. It's well optimized. Only 42 megabytes, you could say. Weapon shop. Craft. Nice. Let's go! Basic underwater okay. rifle! Oh, taking some measures to allow you to open weapon chests underwater. Wait, what? In any case, this master will be watching you. Goodbye. Eternity. What? What does that mean? Bro, nice. You can craft weapons at Duff's weapon shop. Create a blueprint. Acquiring a weapon a certain number of times will complete a blueprint. Making the weapon craftable. Oh! Go hunting with powerful weapons. Weapons can be crafted multiple times. That's what we needed, chat. Oh my god, and we did this. It seems to be in very good condition, almost as if it was stored somewhere until recently. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me they're like making this up, like it's gonna be a fake thing to bring in customers. Very interesting, maybe the find of the century even. Let's continue to work together and uncover the secrets of the Sea People's civilization. That wouldn't be hard to do. I've a very lucky feeling about this. I'll be in touch. Okay. This looks cute. Hi, she's the moose. It has been. It's been really cute. It's a really good game. 300 gold? Olive oil and turmeric. This. I'm hooked, chat. I'm hooked. Damn, I didn't catch any fish that trip, though. Not enough workers. Okay. I have four minutes until I need to go. So I think I'm going to go do one more sushi shift. And then we're going to go. Cutscenes are 15 out of 10. Best part of the game. The cutscenes have been amazing. It's so good. I've been hooked on it for the past week. It's really good. <laughs> one more dive. Wait, who's that? Yoshi? Yoshi? This is Bancho's sushi place, huh? Hmm. But Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cookster. Nice. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A taciturn but masculine chef. Did they mention me too? No. Poor Dave. Seems like something happened between Yoshi and Bancho at some point. That is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion, and that's what got you booted from the hotel. You're talking about that again. That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. How long will you continue treating customers that way to keep making that terrible food? Shark has been used in cuisine in both the, the West and the East, and in Korea it was used in ancestral rituals. You've not changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then whether this food is fit. Okay, let's do. Let's let the food do the talking then. Please get me a white tip reef shark head and olive oil. Oh my god. Take a good gun with you into the battle, bro. 
Bancho expects us to go out there, risk our entire life. Just because his pride is on the line. I'll have to ask Duff to make me a gun or search for one in the blue hole. Oh god. Special customer. Sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and serve them to the customers. Ooh, okay. He would do the same for you though? What? No he wouldn't! What do you mean? Why are you back in Bancho right now? Is it because he's hot? Wait. Um. Wait, are we open? Did I open for business? How have I... I ch chat, I swear I didn't know I'd open for business. Um... The thing is, wait, sh I don't, I don't have a shark head though. What am I gonna do? Um, let's enhance the clownfish. Wait, wait, I've only got one. Oh, she's just gonna stay there until we make- Okay, 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 cool. Um, let's enhance the sea- God, we do not have good fish tonight. Wait, so when I'm enhancing it, I'm only getting one fish back? Right, let's just stack out the menu with that then. How long am I gonna be live? I, I actually needed to go, like, now. So I'm gonna put- I'm gonna do this last sushi run. And then I gotta go. Uh, okay. Soup on it. Perfect soup incoming. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, that's still perfect. Nice. Sorry about the sirens, guys. Ooh, nice. That's a good one. Okay. Right, let's grab this food. Uh, yeah, that's you. Sorry, guys, we don't actually have the best food tonight. I just realized that picture on the wall is actually of, um, Bancho, Dave, and Cobra. Wow, I remembered everyone's names. The ADHD medication is working! I never remember anyone's name. The stream police are here. <laughs> it's because they're men? Okay, man. Also, we've got cooks and reviews popping up here, but the chat's kind of in the way. Thanks, Kajel, man. Oh, we're getting little tips tonight. Not the best menu. Not the best menu, but not the worst menu tonight. Is that the last customer? Oh, we got five out of ten likes up there at the top. Closed for the day. Oh, wow. So we got a cookster rank. Five new likes today. Bro, we only did 44 gold tonight. Only 13 off sub goal. I don't think we're hitting that today, man. I, I gotta go. <laughs> Bancho popped off. Gu guys, what? I don't know how... I get that Bancho, like, seems cool, he looks cool, but he's really mean to Dave, so how can you be Team Bancho right now? Like, Ban uh, Dave is the sweetest person ever. Anyone that's mean to Dave doesn't deserve our love. Oh, wait. I, I analyzed the artifact you brought me, and a large amount of unknown substance was detected. I think it must be iron compressed deep underwater, but it gives off a unique wavelength. I went ahead and developed a radar to track those waves. This radar is bound to become useful on your next expedition. Cobra forced me to go along last time. I was given a contract with your name on it. The cancellation charge for breaking the contract is over 20. Wait, what? 
Check the signal out for me to test the radar. What the hell? Someone signed a contract behind our back, man. Soy Dave? Bro, don't ever talk about Dave like that ever again. Dave deserves the world. He is literally working his ass off for everyone.